What is up, guys? It is John and the Game Master Guys here. What's up, everybody? It's me, XNAB11. Hey, guys, I'm Sparks28. And welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Gold, Silver, and Crystal. So, in the last part, we defeated Janine here, Koga's daughter. And now, we're heading to Lavender Town because something's happening in Kanto. You may think it's just all normal, but you'll see what's happening. So, let's head there. Alright. So. Okay, it's good. Yes, yeah, ride your bike through Saldon City. And, and to uh, Saffron. I, I, mean, I mean, Saffron, yeah, Saffron, yeah. Alright. I'll walk. Alright, there's a bunch of bikers here you gotta deal with, so yeah. We're the Kanto Pokemon Federation Trainer Group. What? We'll, we'll drive under your wheel, or our wheels. We'll drive you under our wheels, I think. Did you say Federation? What? Yeah! <laughs> Federation Trainer Group, I think, whatever he says. <laughs> At first, I thought you would say Federation Force. I mean, they are the colors of them. I was, like, I was gonna think of Metroid Prime at first. <laughs> Federation weird. Force, that is. Look at them, it's like red, green, and blue. All you need is the yellow one. Alright, I'm in Lavender. Already? I you skipped just... Triners. <laughs> I actually ran into them, so let me okay, go. Bet. I guess I gotta speed up past them, man. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, there, are, there is a way to get around those bikers. Yeah, I know, you gotta take the other route, or the, the, the ledges. Yeah. But they're not giving me that much of ex Oh my god. No, because everyone here is pretty weak. Everyone here in Kanto is weak. They're scrubs. Yeah. They need to get good. I mean, hell, look at that 28. <laughs> <laughs> How are you looking at me right now? Right, I was gonna dragon rage the heck out of them. Oh, okay. Oh. He just committed suicide on me. Come on, I wouldn't do that much. Look at that. <laughs> Alright. Small get through a pebble at you. <laughs> Coffee. Look at these coughing. I may as well switch. Let's switch. Uh, you yeah, besides Godzilla. How the basic eats more love? Alright, finally here. Oh, 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 oh. Shh. One thing I can say though. The thing with Lavender Town, it really just changed compared to on Red, Blue, and Yellow is the fact that it's no longer that creepy vibe filling town. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's more or less just... Just a, just a town now. Yeah. I mean, um, Pokemon Tower isn't really much anymore. It's just a radio tower. Yeah, that, that, that's true. I, I guess them having a friggin' um, a giant cemetery in the town was a little too disturbing, so they changed to a radio tower. I, I know, right? Uh -huh. But I think the first thing we're probably going to do first is get the radio cars, since that's probably going to be you know more important later on. Yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and get mine. Let me just check around this town, blah, 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 blah. Uh -huh. I think you can get um, it from right here. Hey there, fellow! I am the super music director. Huh? Your Pokeball... Pokeball... Poke gear can't tune into my music program? How unfortunate. If you can get an e EXBN card upgrade, you can tune in. You better get one. Alright, so he's the guy who tells us about it, so the female behind the desk should give it to us. Who gives it to us, then? Hold up. Is it this guy right here? No, I, I think we have to go to the power plant first. Yeah, you do. Because I think... Yeah, the, and I believe they reward you with that. So, yeah. yeah. Let's get uh, let's get through these trainers. All right. So, where are you guys going? Dark um, dark tunnel or whatever now? Fuck that. Because oh, you, you, you need flash. Fly. Yeah, we, need... Let, let's just head to Cerulean and go from there. Then we, then we can just fly back to Lavender Town and then fly to Cerulean City. Oh yeah, also the music here is less creepy. Yeah. Alright, Saffron, North to Cerulean. Alright, so you guys already, already, so you, are you, you guys already mentioned about the thingy. Yeah, we pretty much mentioned enough about Lavender Town and how it's not pretty much a creepy place, but I think the nickname Raider is still... Yeah, he is. He's yeah, still he's around. still the name Raider, yeah. Yeah, it's kind of funny how they removed, they, they, they moved the bodies to Mr. Fuji's house now. It's kind of, it's kind of fucked up if you think about it. I mean, okay, so Pokemon technology isn't as far ahead as ours is, so how would they move them? It's not like they had like a big crane and then just say... They probably moved, they probably moved their coffins place like one by one, I believe. I don't know. Probably. Those poor Pokemon. Alright. Alright, Cerulean City, it's still the same, but in color. 
<laughs> yeah, obviously. I mean, this spot is open, and then you can go back here. I think he gives like, you an item. Oh, you don't have to cut to get to get to Cerulean City, Cerulean City from the south. There used to be a cave that had horribly powerful Pokemon in it. Oh yeah, unknown dungeon. You're basically Cerulean Cave. That's where Mewtwo was, but now it's gone now. Yep. Preacher, Preacher Red caught it. Yeah, right Limit now. limitations. I mean, it would have made sense if they put it back and then just made another Mewtwo like they did Heart Gold and Soul Silver, but. Oh yeah, in this gym there's nothing yet, so you can't go here. Yeah, until you have to do something. All right, so the monuments from Cerulean Nugget Bridge is just a bridge now. I mean, the trainers did migrate, I think, to Nugget Forest. I think that's what they call it. Oh, yeah, yeah, they're not on the bridge anymore. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to go ahead and start just battling them. Yeah, you, there's no way around these guys. <clears throat> well, guys, at this point, we're halfway there. Yep. Yes, we are. So now he's gonna battle the... So yeah, so the Nugget Bridge is no longer a thing anymore. I believe they changed it to like a Nugget Path or whatever? Or yeah, whatever. Nugget, nugget Forest, I believe. Nugget Path, Nugget Forest, something like that. Yeah, because after here, you get a Nugget for defeating these trainers. Top, quote-unquote, top trainers. I think that's what they called it, I'm not sure. Let's just say they're the top trainers of Cerulean. Let's, let's call it that. I did my best, I have no regrets. They all say that after you beat them. <laughs> Switch Pokemon around a little bit. So before I do the cancel power, cancel power plan here, we're just gonna get these trainers over with. Even though nothing does happen yet after you beat them, like get to do something. I mean, you're still gonna have to beat them later on, so why not now? Yeah. Wiggling top. All right, so bad. Oh, good stuff. Good stuff. And it's nighttime now. I love how almost every episode leads into night. Yeah, it's kind of funny. I think I've helped the base some more love, I swear. Shhh. <laughs> 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 I find that Chris just, just showed up, just, just randomly, like, pop out an egg or whatever. And then just tell it, shh. And there's the Wiggly Tough. It's funny, you, you get how to basic book one, and it said you get, you actually get how to basic. You have to start throwing eggs everywhere. <laughs> So you can't see what it looks like. Yeah. What or what what he actually looks like. Only uh I know Max Melvo knows what he looks like. He's been in a lot of his videos lately. Yeah, I know that. And yeah. uh, also a filthy Frank and Idubs TV. Do you know why do you know why that how the base is hiding his identity? Cause I think I heard why, I believe. I mean it, I mean it, wrong. It, it's more of to preserve it's I forgot the exact reason why he why he said he hides his identity. I think it's more to do with I don't know, it just kind of lets you use your imagination as to what he actually looks like. All we really know about him is that he's, he's an Australian guy who likes to break eggs. And, and show his dick and be naked. <laughs> Pretty sure well, to wear Speedos. Oh yeah, contrary to popular belief, he's not naked. He wears Speedos. So he, he gives the illusion that he's naked, but he's not actually naked. And plus also, um, I so think... If, if he was naked, you know, the, the way the camera's pointing, you'd see his dick. <laughs> Yeah, pretty, basically. <laughs> oh, what? You just redrew it? What? What? That's not gonna make any difference you withdrew it to Vaporeon. Whatever. He just wasted a turn. You have no chance. Basically. So, yeah, as I was saying, well, if I've heard from the Fine Bros, I mean, I don't, I think so. I mean, I think so, but, uh, I think, I think he has an identity because he doesn't want to get embarrassed of what people actually looks like because of the things he does or whatever. Yeah, that, that might have something to do with it, too. You know, let's get throw a rock at it. Let's throw rocks at this tangular thing. I don't understand. I mean, if I crack eggs for a living just to get money, I wouldn't want people to know about it. <laughs> well, yeah, but at the same time, you gotta think that's how he's making money. That's actually pretty cool. J yeah, just wasting food. Yeah. <laughs> Well, they're expired food from what most people are saying. E even if it's not expired food, you know, it. he's buying... I really, you know, pe people give him give him crap for wasting food. I'm like, I really don't care. Yes, his food. Let him mess with yeah, it the way he wants it. He bought the food fair and square. He, he gets to do what he wants with it. 
can just walk up to a person like if they have a game and you say that game sucks go turn it back in <laughs> yeah it's like that's that that's their opinion my opinion might be like hey i think this game's okay you know it's so go fuck yourself <laughs> all right to heal my pokemon and then later on that person wants to play the game <laughs> <laughs> yeah, i want to play too <laughs> I should really buy some. Oh yeah, by the way. Oh yeah, the door is now locked because of the bike seller who freaking sells a million dollars of a bike moved to Joe, so he could try and get money there. Which... He had to sell one bike just to relocate. <laughs> if you want to get the bike in Canada, you need, you need that's Trump for a small loan of a million dollars. No, he'll think that you know. If you take a million dollars away from him, he'll think that's too much. Uh, or at least, or whatever, something like that. You guys know that he's now become the 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 the, the one. He's now the, the the Republican front runner or whatever the term is. I don't know. I don't know. So the one that basically, um, if you had to pick between who you want to vote for, it'd be he's this one. Of, he's one of them now. Yes. Oh my god. So now we're just waiting for, for the for the Democrats to choose their rep representative. Which, All right. From, the, from what I'm hearing, it might be Hillary Clinton. Hopefully not Bernie Sanders. <laughs> Everyone's making jokes at Bernie. It's kind of funny though. Bernie Mac without a crack. So what trainer are you guys in? I'm on number five. I don't even know. I'm just on a trainer. Like I said, I'm going slow. I don't have a lot of enthusiasm. I mean, I do, but I don't. It's like the worst time to have allergies. Hey, Giotto, I see. I did my best. I have no regrets. How about you shut the fuck up? Is that the person said? Or the NPC? Yeah, they all keep saying that after you beat them. It's like, okay, I get it. I have no regrets. I, reg I regret facing you. Your, your, that. Your, regret should, your regret should be that you did not get good. Look, even a boosted experience doesn't give you much still. Because that's, oh. that's how weak they are. And the, the last last one in line. It's giving me the doubts that I'm gonna get my Tyranitar by this by then. It's giving me doubts. I don't know, I may get it. We're almost done with this. I, well, man, I don't know, you may have to grind off cam if you want to get Tyranitar for this. Let's be- How the- How much- The only way I can get is the Elite Four, I believe. Pretty sure. Probably, I'm pretty, yeah. I'm pretty sure I can rematch them still. You gotta go oh, the there's you. If this was Gen 3, I'd be- I'd be fighting you two. Or, yeah. I believe you have one double battle at least somewhere around here, hard mode silver. I may be wrong though. I'm playing my how to basic take care of this. Just because it's kind of under leveled to my, compared to my other team. And plus, luckily I get my Tyranitar, or Pupitar, the experience share. It's not level 53 right now. I it was <coughs> at 55, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah, so I can also wait then. Yeah. Okay, I thought I leveled up at first, but no, because they had like a long pause, but no, I just defeated the trainer. Alright, oh, there you are, what do you want? I'm, I'm the last in line, but I can tell you, I'm tough. Well, shit, like, people here in Kanto are weak as fuck. Yep. Come on, Kanto, you gotta step it up. The best Pokemon from Mount Moon, Paris. <laughs> Who's, who has a similar cry as Mew? No, 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 no. I'm just spamming Psychic, I'm just... I'm just spamming Psychic to everyone here. <clears throat> this Gatorade really came in handy with Ice Punch. <laughs> That's my boy! Oh, uh, there's more Paris! <laughs> you know what? See, am I the only one who thinks that Paris sounds like Mew? Kinda, kinda does. Well, well, I know that some Pokemon have similar cries in like in the early generations. Yeah, like Charizard and Rhydon. I mean, Rhyborn. Yeah. This guy waited to beat me after the other trainers just because he thought I was going to be tired. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I'm going to probably give him the most hell out of everyone else. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I'm stopping this Parasect here. I should have one-hit one hit kill it because, you know, <clears throat> stopping bugs. Kills them, but you know it's a normal type move. So yeah, it's just no, just just neutral damage. You're funny. Uh, All right, one more trainer. I I think it's one more trainer. Uh, <gasps> I know what to do with the six pack trainers. I wait here, so I wait, I wait here to beat you when you were tired. And, okay, whatever. I'm not tired at all. I'm wide awake here, kid. 
I'll crush you. Look at you nerd talking shit. Pat. Oh, oh she has a party on. Oh, I had to battle him too? Why? <laughs> oh my gosh. It's funny, because after we beat these trainers, we get nothing. Well, not yet, anyways. But like Jeremy says, it's best to get it over with now. So this whole episode's been nothing but battling and showing off how good we are. Yeah, basically. Much. All right, yeah, so took care of super nerd. Sure, yeah. I'm not tired at all, you you nerd. You took you took on one more battle than you expected, but you won anyway. As promised, you win a prize. I got the nugget. Now can I leave now? <laughs> that sounds funny. But after seeing how you battle, I want to battle. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're not done yet. Whatever. You remind me that one Team Rocket grunt who who just they gave me a nugget and just want me want me to join this stupid clan. But whatever. Yeah. All right, time to take care of you then. Cool trainer, you're not even that cool. What makes you cool is that you give me the nugget. But after giving me the nugget, you ask for a battle. You already like, forced me to battle you. It's like, I, it's like, yeah, you give me the nugget, but now you can go fuck off. <laughs> yeah, you sh yeah, you should be cool like that, not asking me to battle. Yeah, you know what? Hey, bug catcher, fuck you. You know what, Charmeleon? F whatever, I'm gonna burn its tail. I'm gonna freaking not water, freaking wet its tail. Let's do this. Alright, I beat him, yay. One more level for that Charmeleon, and it would've evolved. Alright, let's Hydro Pump this, uh, or Surf this thing. Calabunga! Woohoo! Surfing! Yeah! Take that! Oh, I really... crap, I think if we're headed to the power plant, we actually went the wrong way. I know! Fuck. I told you, like I said, nothing happens. Yeah. I hear we were just doing this to do this. I guess, it... yeah. <laughs> Well, don't worry. Once we, once we, once something, once any event happens, it's all worth it. Yeah. We don't have to battle these anymore. Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are gonna have to go back there. So yeah, it's best. Like, it's, like you said, it's best to get those trainers out of the way. Say, <laughs> so, Jerry. So explain about Bill's Cottage, if you like. All right, Bill's Cottage. Back in red, blue, and yellow. Of course, you know Bill lived here. He was a Pokemon, and we helped him, and he gave us the ticket to the Saint Anne or the SS Anne. Here in gold, silver, and crystal, his granddad lives here, and if you bring him a Pokemon that he requests, by get, he'll give you a description. Like, like Lickitung, I know is one of them. He'll ask for a Pokemon with a long tongue. If you bring him that certain Pokemon, he'll give you a stone. Mm-hmm. Yeah, which Jeremy got for me. That's how I got my Arcanine early. Like, I know if you bring him back, it's like one fire Pokemon he'll ask for. If you bring him back that, he'll give you a fire stone. So yeah, it's kind of a, kind of, it's kind of a nice-ish thing, I guess. Yeah. It gives me more stuff to do, I guess. Just go hunt for some for some Pokemon. All right. All right. So we got that covered. So, so you guys ready to chill for a bit? Sure. All right, guys. So we wrap this up here. So I know it was a bit of a filler-ish episode here. I know we kind of, I know we purposely took the wrong way. Well, I did anyway. But yeah, I know nothing was gonna happen yet because Misty is supposed to be there. Um, but you have to like solve the uh, the power plant issue first before that happens. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, right now we're gonna rest up in the Pokemon Center, and we'll see you guys next part. Thanks for watching, guys. Feel free to comment, like, and subscribe for more Gold Silver content and other gaming stuff here in this channel. And the next part, we'll be heading to the Kanto Power Plant. See what's up there. So yeah, bye guys. Bye. bye.